All right, let's get to it. Hey guys, Anime Gamer 75 here. Welcome back to the Dynasty Warriors 7 playthrough. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the uh, the playthrough so far. On the last episode, I learned we just started uh, chapter uh, uh, two on the shoe store line. Right now, we're here at Turby. Uh, for those that don't know, we on the last episode it was Shinya and Battle of Changban. There were two actually two parts in Changban. That's why it was a long episode. So yeah, we just started. Um, Chapter two. I thought we we're going to three already, but I was indeed right. Where were we were on um, uh, on the second chapter? With this battle, we must set the stage for the three kingdoms to be formed. However, Cao Cao will not make it easy for us. Lord strategist. Never mind. It's nothing. So there's the altar, and if I, if my memory serves, that's a, this is also a, um, a two-part mission. Why does the fire attack have to wait for the wind? If we start the fire now, it will simply turn back upon us. I don't believe all this prayer nonsense is going to change the winds. Are you sure we can trust this guy? Guess we'll have to find out, huh, Zhang Fei? So let's see. Yeah, I'm still gonna get um, uh, Dynasty Warriors 8 and the Extreme Legends um, uh, expansion on PlayStation 3, but I will eventually gonna get the uh, the complete version on the uh, on the Vita. Combat resistance. I think I'm gonna get that. Yeah, they're gonna get a little bit expensive. <laughs> Gets a good um, uh, muso. Oh, okay, dragon spike. 444 on points. Let's see what am I going to use here. 280. Which I'm going to use here. Hmm. Might as well use it. So right now they have um, uh, three musos each. But like I mentioned before. Um different attributes pretty much <laughs> sealed master This one's gonna go defense up. Yeah, I got a feeling this will go a little fast. Combat and attack range. I think I got some good uh, seals to be obtained here. So having said that, the battle turby begins. Lord Zhao Yun, how goes Lord Juga Liang's preparations? He has just begun the prayer ceremony. It's all up to him now. Lord Zhao Yun! I come with orders from Lord Zhuge Liang. He wishes us to quietly begin the march. Quietly? We are to work our way around at Cao Cao's escape route, and he wants us to strike before Sun Quan's army can. I understand. I will leave Lord Zhang Fei in charge of guarding the prayer ceremony. Yes, my lord. Lord Liu Qi, will you please lend me your strength? Of course, Lord Zhao Yun. You have my gratitude. Now we must hurry.
So we're nearly getting started. Lord Chapter Bloody 2 of the uh, the shoe storyline. I wish I knew what our strategist was thinking. How can he possibly overcome these numbers? And just what is this plan of his anyway? Okay, we're boarding the ship number one. And I believe, if memory serves me right. Oh, yeah. The boat moves. All right, we're in. I am in your hands. You must block off the egress of South South's army. Sit back and observe the skills of a true Navy man. Thanks to the ballista we equipped, we equipped. Ha! There you go. So we move on. There's South South. I think I wanna keep firing. Whoops. Oh, and just where do you think you're going? Ow, 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 ow! All right, you're ruining my fine. Now I ruin yours. Hmm. You're the man. How did you get it? There you go. Too late. <laughs> now where's that? Ah. Okay, lucky them. Okay, he got away. Or did he? Wait, 
Okay. Uh oh. Ooh. There you go. Short one for Xiao Yun. I believe Zuga Liang is playable here next, if I recall correctly. So I, I was right, this is a two-parter. I think from now on I should do this. If it's only one part, I'm gonna do one part. If it's a two-parter, Whenever the time allowed, I'm gonna pretty much press on. It would appear that Cao Cao has already begun his retreat. Forgive me, Lord Zhuge Liang. Please give me the order to pursue after him. Indeed. Godspeed, Zhao Yuan. Guan Yu. I would like for you to accompany him. Our victory is not complete until Cao Cao is eliminated. Lord Zhuge Liang, I... I ask that you do it for the sake of our Lord. Oh, it's Guan Yu. Okay. I think I'll, I'll be uh, playing Zhuge Liang a little later. Probably not this battle. Ooh, 976. I think I may have a good one here. Unless I've done it already. No, I haven't yet. So let's take care of this. You know what? Might as well. So the last one is Power Up Plus. Second Muso. Probably the cheaper one, so. Actually, I'm gonna change weapons here. The quicker the seals I have, the better. So combat resistance, and then I'll do dragon spike next. Welcome. I don't think I bought enough. Yeah. Okay, this is the last one for now. So let's see. Who am I gonna talk here? Zhang Fei has gone on ahead. We must pick up the pace if we are to catch up in time. So it's Guan Ping, I believe, leading us off. I ask that you do it for the sake of our Lord. I have failed in my task. There is no excuse. Other than that, let's go. Cao Cao couldn't have gotten very far. Father, let's hurry after him. Huh. Now, to Cao Cao. Part 2 in the battle turby begins. Here we go. Have a weapon here. What I got here? Stove crusher. We shall 
take a moment to review our ranks before we march. So let's review mission here. Okay. Defeat Cao Cao. Game over it's if either Zhuge Liang's defeated or Cao Cao reaches the escape point. Obviously, of course. Not gonna make much. go I hate to say this but we're going to need reinforcements Okay. Sparking, sparkling draft. <laughs> ow, 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 ow. I guess the old saying is shortcuts not allowed. Apparently that's true in this case. Report. It seems that the Allied reinforcements have arrived. You've done enough. I do not need your help, my boy. I must finish this myself. Fight me now! For glory! Ooh, okay. Now that's how it's done. You inspire us all. There you go. So I got attack range, now combat resistance. You can't kill our lord, can't you? 
Silence! I will take Lord Salto's head. I have no choice. Out of my way! Bring news. We've discovered another path. They're trying to sneak their way in. Crush anyone who tries to get through. We can't afford to lose any more of our allies. Our scouts have spotted Saltel's men resting. If we hurry, we might catch them. Hmm. Father, it looks like we can climb up here. to victory. Continue on west, Father. I will sneak up on South South from the south. Excellent, Father. Well done, as always. Cannot fall behind. <laughs> Let's see if you can get through my defenses. Is there no one? There you are. Stand your ground, my lord. Face you. What's the matter? Aren't you here to kill me? Of course I am. I cannot. Ooh, okay, okay. Free. Gotta watch it. If it's a fight you want, then you come to the right place. Uh oh. Huh. Missed me. Okay, okay. Not much. This will end it. There you go. Go. Sao Tso. I just couldn't. I know. I had already taken that fact into consideration. With this, the stage is now set for Lord Liu Bei's rise to power. It is time to walk a path fraught with great danger. The alliance between Liu Bei and Sun Quan struck a resounding victory at Chervi. This crushing defeat forced Cao Cao to put his ambitions on hold. However, as Cao Cao had managed to escape unharmed, Sun Quan was unable to take any decisive actions. As long as Cao Cao was alive, 
they must slowly chip away at his strength and work towards building their ideal world. This was Juga Leong's plan to help Liu Bei turn his dream into reality. With Cao Cao unable to strike, Liu Bei turned his attention away from Sun Quan and built up his military forces. He then invaded four of the territories in southern Jing. Upon being sent to attack Changsha, Guan Yu found himself face to face with a most powerful opponent. It was the veteran general Huang Zhang, who served beneath Han Xuan, the prefect of Changsha. Han Xuan is a weakling. But if he has experienced officers in his ranks, then this may take some time. against you, Lord Guan Yu. Do what you will with us, but please spare the innocents in the castle. Our brother will treat you all with mercy. And so, Liu Bei obtained the four territories of Southern Jing, as well as the skilled officers Wei Yan and Huang Zhang. He was also joined by the strategist Pang Tong, who was said to be a match for even Zhuge Liang himself. Meanwhile, in return for his assistance at Chirbi, Sun Quan demanded that Liu Bei hand over Jing. Zhuge Liang replied only that they would eventually return the province, but he did not give a clear answer as to when. Furious though he was, Sun Quan deemed it too dangerous to attack Liu Bei at that time. Instead, he sent his younger sister, Sun Xiangxiang, to marry Liu Bei in the hope that it would improve relations between the two kingdoms. It was then that Liu Bei received a request for reinforcements from Liu Zhang of Yi. Fearful of Cao Cao after his conquering of Guan Zhang, he had come to ask his relative Liu Bei for assistance. Zhuge Liang and Pang Tong recommended that they go on the pretense of assisting Liu Zhang, but then attack him instead. The land of Yi to the west, also known as Ba Shu, if Liu Bei could capture that territory, then the land would be divided in three between Cao Cao, Sun Quan, and himself. This was the path to his land of virtue. This was Zhuge Liang's Three Kingdoms strategy. Though he did move to assist Pang Tong and the others, Liu Bei did not attack Liu Zhang. Even standing before Yi's Loa Castle, he did not make a move. For within him was a virtuous heart that he could not turn against. So we end the videos, so we begin uh, Pang Tong mm -hmm. at Luo Castle. So you won't consider attacking Chung Du, huh? I cannot betray Lord Liu Chang. But my lord, the people of Yi province desire your rule. Silence. My army stays put. That is an order.
now then. I hope you don't mind helping me out, lads. Not at all! I crush enemy! So Pong Tong will be playable here on Luol Castle. So I'm going to go ahead and end the video here for this part of the Dynasty Warriors 7 playthrough. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the ride as much as I have so far. Uh, don't forget uh, Dynasty Warriors 8 Extreme Legends is coming to the PlayStation 3 on March the 25th uh, for the PlayStation uh, systems. Uh, the expansion pack on PlayStation 3 and the complete editions on both PlayStation 4 and on Vita. Again, thanks a lot for tuning in. And as always, if you like any of the videos here, comment, like, and subscribe. I'll be on Twitter. Just follow me there. Uh, thanks for watching. Take care and God bless. See ya.